Get advice from local experts with the top eight things you need to know. Locally owned Traditions at North Willow recommends features and services to consider when choosing a senior living community. Log on to wishtop8.com. Find what you need to know when you need to know it. Log on to wishtop8.com for how-to tips, videos, and more. The top eight things where you'll find just what you need when you need it. Heating, cooling, and air quality are all things we often take for granted until something goes wrong. There are many things we can do ourselves to keep our homes healthy and comfortable. Here's Tracy Fornart with the top eight things you need to know to maintain your home systems from our sponsor partner. Indiana weather can mean high humidity in our homes. You know that sticky feeling you get when the temperatures rise and AC just can't keep up? LCS Heating and Cooling explains why a dehumidifier may be just what you need in this installment of the top eight things you need to know. The top eight things you need to know is sponsored by LCS Heating and Cooling. My name is Renee with LCS Heating and Cooling. So this time of year is what we like to refer to as it's sticky. You know what I'm talking about. It feels cool inside, your thermostat is set at 70, and it is 70, but it still just feels sticky. Well, that is all about humidity. And Indiana is a perfect example of how it can be cool outside, but the humidity can be quite high. That's what gives you that sticky, uncomfortable, wet feeling that sometimes you feel inside of your home. So, how do you get rid of it? Well, you know, in the wintertime, we've talked about whole house humidifiers, portable humidifiers, whatever your need might be. The same applies for the summer, just the opposite, a dehumidifier. We need something to remove that moisture from the air. Now, there are two options. If you have a specific space that you would like to remove humidity from, a portable dehumidifier might be perfect for you. You could go to your local home improvement store, you could pick one up. You do need to make sure that you have a drain nearby so the water can drain out. A good example, most people might have it in their basement. The humidity feels really high, it feels kind of wet down there. Have that portable dehumidifier and that'll take care of it for you. Now, if you have an issue throughout your whole house, um, it's not unusual for humidity levels to get up to 60 plus percent. That's really high and can feel really uncomfortable, even though the temperature is good. So a whole house dehumidifier might be the better option. We've actually got one here that we're getting ready to install. And as you can see, it'll actually duct right into the return and the ductwork. And so that will actually remove humidity from the whole entire house, not just one small space. Once you get that humidity out of there, you won't believe the difference that you'll feel and how cool it'll feel. As a matter of fact, the first year that my husband Travis and I had our dehumidifier installed, we didn't even have to turn our air conditioner on as early as usual. I think it was almost June that year, just because it felt that much cooler. So, a couple of options for you. You pick what works best for you, and if you need a quote for that whole house dehumidifier or just more information, please reach out to us through our website. For more top eight things you need to know when you need them, Go to wishtop8.com. The Top 8 Things is sponsored by LCS Heating and Cooling. Hi, I'm Dr. Fang from Price Vision Group. Have you ever wondered why you need reading glasses? I get this question a lot, partly because it's a universal problem. Hi, I'm John Hartley with Pure Air Environmental. Today we're here at this home to talk about radon mitigation. So you've tested and it's failed. What do you do next? Hi, this is Cami from Wickerworks. And uh, probably one of the biggest questions people ask me is can my outdoor furniture and my fabric take the elements of the weather? And what I do, it's a very simple solution of bleach, soap and water mixed together. I spray it on, use a little bit of elbow grease with a brush, Wipe it off and it comes out beautifully. No stress, no mess.